The Java Message Service API is a Java message-oriented middleware API for sending messages between two or more clients. JMS is a part of the Java platform, Enterprise Edition, and is defined by a specification developed under the Java Community Process as JS914. It is a messaging standard that allows application components based on the Java Enterprise Edition to create, send, receive, and read messages. It allows the communication between different components of a distributed application to be loosely coupled, reliable, and asynchronous. General idea of messaging Messaging is a form of loosely coupled distributed communication, where in this context the term communication can be understood as an exchange of messages between software components. Message-oriented technologies attempt to relax tightly coupled communication by the introduction of an intermediary component. This approach allows software components to communicate indirectly with each other. Benefits of this include message senders not needing to have precise knowledge of their receivers. The advantages of messaging include the ability to integrate heterogeneous platforms, reduce system bottlenecks, increase scalability, and respond more quickly to change. Version History JMS 1.0.2b, JMS 1.1, JMS 2.0 JMS 2.0 is maintained under the Java Community Process as JS 343. Elements The following are JMS elements, JMS provider, an implementation of the JMS interface for a message-oriented middleware. Providers are implemented as either a Java JMS implementation or an adapter to a non-Java MOM. JMS client, an application or process that produces and or receives messages. JMS Producer Publisher, a JMS client that creates and sends messages. JMS Consumer Subscriber, a JMS client that receives messages. JMS Message, an object that contains the data being transferred between JMS clients. JMS Queue, a staging area that contains messages that have been sent and are waiting to be read. Note that, contrary to what the name queue suggests, Messages don't have to be delivered in the order sent. A JMS queue only guarantees that each message is processed only once. JMS Topic, a distribution mechanism for publishing messages that are delivered to multiple subscribers. Models, the JMS API supports two models, point-to-point, -point, publish and subscribe, point-to-point -point model, in point-to-point -point messaging system. Messages are routed to an individual consumer which maintains a queue of incoming messages. This messaging type is built on the concept of message queues, senders, and receivers. Each message is addressed to a specific queue, and the receiving clients extract messages from the queues established to hold their messages. While any number of producers can send messages to the queue, each message is guaranteed to be delivered, and consumed by one consumer. Queues retain all messages sent to them until the messages are consumed or until the messages expire. If no consumers are registered to consume the messages, the queue holds them until a consumer registers to consume them. Publish Subscribe Model The Publish Subscribe Model supports publishing messages to a particular message topic. Subscribers may register interest in receiving messages on a particular message topic. In this model, Neither the publisher nor the subscriber knows about each other. A good analogy for this is an anonymous bulletin board. Zero or more consumers will receive the message. There is a timing dependency between publishers and subscribers. The publisher has to create a message topic for clients to subscribe. The subscriber has to remain continuously active to receive messages, unless it has established a durable subscription. In that case, Messages published while the subscriber is not connected will be redistributed whenever it reconnects. JMS provides a way of separating the application from the transport layer of providing data. The same Java classes can be used to communicate with different JMS providers by using the Java naming and directory interface information for the desired provider. The classes first use a connection factory to connect to the queue or topic and then use populate and send or publish the messages. On the receiving side, the clients then receive or subscribe to the messages. URI scheme, RFC 6167 defines a JMS, 
URI scheme for the Java Message Service. Provider implementations To use JMS, one must have a JMS provider that can manage the sessions and queues. Starting from Java EE version 1.4, JMS provider has to be contained in all Java EE application servers. This can be implemented using the message and flow management of the Java EE connector architecture, which was first made available in that version. The following is a list of JMS providers, Apache ActiveMQ, Redis PubSub, Apache QPID, using AMQP, Oracle WebLogic and Oracle AQ from Oracle, EMS from TIBCO, FFMQ, GNUL GPL licensed, JBOSS Messaging and Hornet Q from JBOSS, JORAM, from the OW2 Consortium, Open Message Q, from Oracle, Open JMS, from the Open JMS Group, Solace JMS from Solace Systems, Rabbit MQ by Rabbit Technologies Limited, acquired by Spring Source, SAP NetWeaver Process Integration, Sonic MQ from Aurea Software, Swift MQ, Tivella, Ultra Messaging from 29 West, Web Methods from Software AG, Web Sphere Application Server from IBM, which provides an inbuilt default messaging provider known as the Service Integration Bus, or which can connect to Web Sphere MQ as a JMS provider, Web Sphere MQ from IBM, Fiora Normg, a historical comparison matrix of JMS providers from 2005 is available at HTTP www.theserverside.com matrix tss see also message driven beans message queue the concept underlying jms service oriented architecture event driven soa messaging technologies that do not implement the jms api include advanced message queuing protocol a euro standardized message queue protocol with multiple independent implementations amazon simple queue service commoditized messaging service provided by Amazon.com for a per-use fee. It allows users to rent access to messaging without having to maintain their own server. Data Distribution Service, an object management group standardized real-time messaging system with over 10 implementations that have demonstrated interoperability between publishers and subscribers, Microsoft Message Queuing, similar technology, implemented for .NET Framework. References Further reading, Richards, Mark. Richard Monson Haifel. David A. Chappell. Java Message Service, 2nd Edition O'Reilly. ISBN A978-0-596-52000-1. External links, Oracle's JMS Overview, Oracle Docs, Oracle's JMS Tutorial, Javax JMS API Java Doc Documentation, Generic Resource Adapter for JMS, Software AG Web Methods Broker, TIBCO Enterprise Message Service, Review Open Source JMS Implementations, Open Source JMS Implementations, Fiora Normc JMS Performance Comparison, Solace Releases World a Euro Unregistered Trademark S Fastest JMS Broker, Default Messaging in Web Sphere Application Server, JMS in Web Sphere MQ, JMS 2.0, JSA 343